Hi there, I'm Justin Howard and I work for Staccato as a Windows developer over here in our Cambridge office. What I'm going to do today is show you our wireless dock solution. This is something that's ideal both in terms of being used within the home or the small office or also shows you the kind of vision of where you might have similar functionality within a set-top box uh, underneath your TV. In this particular case what we're going to do is we're going to show how uh, all of the wires you would typically plug into your laptop or computer when you come into the home can all be taken by this device and then you simply need to turn on your laptop and then you can start using it. So if you look at the back of this what you'll see is we have um, our typical kind of USB home hub connections, a connection for the monitor such that we can um, re-output wirelessly everything that we would normally see on the desktop as well as audio connections and a uh, front hub that you would typically use for a keyboard or something else. And in fact, if you look behind me, that's exactly what we've got. The TV is being used uh, as an equivalent of a monitor. We then have speakers, a keyboard, and a mouse. So I'll go ahead and plug these things in. I'll plug the audio into the audio connector at the back. The USB for the keyboard will actually go in the front. And we'll also plug the monitor um, in the back as well like so. Okay. Now in order to make this a slightly more interesting demonstration, what I've also done, oh, and power, of course, um, what I've also done is I've connected the mouse through the keyboard to the dock, uh, just to show the various combinations that you can use. That's not necessary. I could plug it into the back, I could plug it into the front. It's really not important. Um, okay, so what's the other half of this? Well, this is the wireless USB dongle that sits, plugs into the computer. Um, this is either an HWA device, which is what this happens to be, uh, or it could also be a proxy device with one of our newer products. Um, this whole technology is also being integrated into PCs themselves, but in terms of a demonstration, I thought it was interesting for you to see individual parts of this together. So I'm going to now plug this into the computer, and from the second one, so you should basically be able to see what's going on. So I'll just move that up there. Okay, so a connection is now being formed between the um, computer and the dock, and all of the services that would typically be inside this computer are being augmented from the dock and the things that we have here. So the first thing that you heard was the sound coming through as that was connected, and the graphics was hooked up, and now if I basically take the mouse, I can also move it onto the desktop as well. So the whole thing is, is a live equivalent. I don't need to use this computer anymore in order to control everything that I see. So what I'll do now is, if I go in here and I choose a video file to play, I can simply double click on it, uh, and then move it over to the desktop, or it's appeared there right away, and then it will go ahead and start playing in a normal kind of way. I can then make that full screen if I wish, just by double clicking on it, and then we get the whole integrated high definition experience going through. Um, Playback is entirely limited to whatever the resolution is that you have on your Windows desktop. In this particular case, we're running on an HD source connected to effectively an HD monitor. I can also take this out and show you the equivalent of how um, videos and DVDs are done. So if I close this down, and then I'll go in on the main computer and access Power DVD to play back my DVDs. And I'll move it over to the main computer so that you can actually see it on the larger monitor. So that's the control panel moved over, and then that's the desktop. Okay, so if I hit play there, there's a DVD already in the drive, and it'll just take a while to spin up, because Windows isn't too fast on this, uh, and it will go through the startup sequence. I, during this, there's, there's no limitations. I have full access to the keyboard. I can access everything that you would normally access on a keyboard. Um, I could even flip the desktop over if I wanted to. In this particular case, I'll make it full screen. And I should have the ability to do pause, rewind, all the normal things that I would normally do with my player, but now I'm just doing it with a little tiny, tiny infrared remote that I have for the main computer. But it could be something that was plugged in via the USB as well. It's not really critical. So all of the elements that can be put together to make um, uh, an integrated set-top experience for within the, the home living room environment, or anything that would uh, be in terms of the home office where you'd want these types of things, 
it can all be integrated and seamlessly connect whenever you go in the home. You don't need to worry about connecting any wires into the system, you don't need to worry about um, any um, setup every time that you form a connection. You just simply go, you use, you leave. A fully integrated wireless USB type of experience. Thanks for watching.